I'm here today with Mark Paradise. I'm Emily Pritt, and we're going to talk about reasons you should attend our Global Taproot Summit and probably the top five no, reasons. No, we're not talking about reasons. We're talking about excuses. The top five excuses. People make <laughs> excuses. I'll talk to people, and they say, well, i really like to come to the summit, but we can't travel this year because of COVID. Well, there's excuse number one. We okay. can't travel because of COVID. So that is not an excuse. Why not? Because we're going to have a virtual summit this year, mm -hmm. and you can sit there in your kitchen with your laptop open and be at the summit. So mm -hmm. not tr no travel, that's no excuse. In fact, you know, the second excuse I hear often hear is, oh, I'm so, oh, we don't have much money this year. You know, it's COVID, there's no money. And, and I'm talking about big, huge companies tell me they've got no money. Mm -hmm. Listen. You can go to the summit virtually and save, it's like saving half off the summit price because right. you don't have to pay for your travel. So that, oh, we got no money excuse, that's not a good excuse. That's just, you got, you can get here, you can go to the summit, you can do it virtually. Uh -huh. And everybody knows, maybe they don't know that we're going to do a virtual summit. We have both. We have it virtually and in person. And we'd love for you to come in person. That's the best experience. It's but, the gold standard. Right. But well, we have a, a, a platform where virtually you can still experience the summit. We've got some integrations into our virtual platform to make it as close to being here in person. You can talk to people over your phone, to people who are at the summit. Mm -hmm. So that's a pretty cool thing. So it's almost like you can, you know, I'd call up Emily and or virtually call her up and she's going to appear on my phone and we can talk about some questions I've got for her after I saw her presentation at the summit. I'm presenting now. No, you're not. But this is like a this is like a <laughs> thing, know. you know, we're, yeah. we're just explaining. And so uh you know, that's that's two of the five standard mm -hmm. out of the way. Yeah. So we have some others here. We talked about uh, your company won't let you travel. You don't have the budget. Um, what about it won't be worthwhile? You know, I've, I actually nobody tells that to me when I'm talking to them. But I've heard people, other people say, you know, I just don't know if it's worthwhile to go to these things. It takes a lot of time, you know, and, and I'm not sure it'll be, I'll get my worth out of it. Mm -hmm. Well, first off, we have a, a guarantee, an sure. ROI guarantee mm -hmm. for the summit that you will, um, take back 10 times, the ideas you have will save 10 times the amount of money it costs you to go to the summit. So if they don't feel like they've saved anything, the guarantee says that we'll refund. We'll refund their money. Yeah. So I don't think there's a worry about it. Now the other thing is we're going to stop here and put a couple videos in for you to watch of people who've been to past summits. And uh, a few, there's a few individuals who came and there's a team who came mm -hmm. and you can see if they thought it was worthwhile to come to the summit. So stop, watch these videos now and we'll be right back. Different aspects of the business for industrial. Um, I think that all of the breakout sessions were very meaningful and I think that everyone that's in, you know, health and safety or quality Anything that has a process that could possibly be fixed, they should come to this summit um, because they can learn different things. Um, you know, the, the keynote speakers, they, they really, they're really impactful, really impactful. Uh, Jim Weatherby, uh, uh, day one. Um, you know, Mark this morning and then Candace this afternoon. Really looking forward to Spencer Stone tomorrow. Um, you know, the keynote speakers do have that that impact on everything. Um, so far it's been listening to other agencies and see how they apply Taproot um, to what we've already learnt. But I, I've been curious to see how different organizations as diverse as they are, implement it and use it every day and what they use from what they find from the corrective actions. But what I've learned a lot about Taproot this week is focusing on the quality uh, issues, uh, improving our processes, improving the way that we deliver energy to our customers. So you're looking forward to Horseshoe Bay next I year? I am, absolutely, yes. It's always Horseshoe. a favorite venue of ours, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Beautiful place. <laughs> Oh.
one of the sessions that I attended was with Bruce Huber, um, really good speaker. Um, he brought a lot of uh, information, not just about how we do our jobs, but how we're more, how we do our jobs more effectively, and how we take that home to our families, and how to better each each one as a whole. So it was very good. We as a team are going to share all of our taproot investigations with each other. We're all from different regions. We're all over Canada. I'm in Pennsylvania. He's in North Dakota. So by getting an incident, sharing it across the board, we're going to be able to bounce ideas off each other and find out, well, I've had this happen before and this is what we did and our corrective actions are going to get a lot better because of it. The reception was great. It was a good opportunity to get out and network, meet other companies, uh, hang out with each other, watch some good music and really just relax at the end of the day. It was nice to step forward a little bit. This, so this, might this was great. a great opportunity. Uh, our team is spread across a number of different regions across Canada and the U.S. Um, it was the first opportunity we've had to get the full team together. Um, we had some exercises with some questionnaires uh, assigned and some fun assignments were assigned to group members for uh, throughout the week. And uh, it really brought us closer as a team. We had the opportunity to share some laughs and attend a lot of good sessions. All right, they've seen the videos. Um, let's go on to another one. So another excuse we hear is, I don't have the time. I don't have the time. Nobody has time anymore, you know? Anybody, anybody have time anymore? Nobody has time. But if you're gonna learn things, so say I could have you go to the summit and you can take back the information you need to save somebody's life. Is it worth it? Is it worth the time? I think Let's so. say you, you get, you have, you're going to prevent a major accident when you get back. It was going to blow up some major unit at your facility. You got, you got the time to do that? Mm -hmm. So and the other one you think of, even your personal self, maybe this is the information I need that's going to get me a promotion sometime in the future. Well, maybe you got time for that. Yeah. So it's all how you're going to invest your time is the way mm -hmm. I look at it. And I think this time at the summit is a worthwhile investment. I agree. And we also have an excuse that, well, somebody's already attending from my company. I don't need to go. That's a, that's a good one. I like it. So that person will bring back all the knowledge and share it among us oh, of course. when they get back. Yeah. <laughs> that, that is not how the summit works. There, is, there are things you bring back and do. But there's an experience of being at the summit, and a single person can't bring that experience back. In fact, we recommend that people bring teams to the summit. In the video you just right. saw, there was a team of people, and they came to the summit, and they all went to different sessions, and they all learned different things, and they'd all get together every night and share their ideas, and it, it builds. That builds teamwork, it builds camaraderie, and, and you get a whole team of people excited when you get back. And so it isn't just one person bringing back the word, one person trying to get this accomplished, it's a whole team of people trying to get things accomplished, mm -hmm. and that has a lot more chance of success. That's a way to, to maximize all the sessions that we have. One person can't go to all of them. And even if you watch them all on your phone, because mm -hmm. you can watch the virtual thing, it's not the same. And if you got all that knowledge, you're still just one person bringing that back, and then you've got to get the struggle of getting everybody else on board, where if you bring a whole team and they all go back, there's a lot more help getting the message across and getting things started when you get back. Absolutely. So that's why there's no excuses. That's it. No, no excuses. excuses uh, to not attend our 2021 Taproot Summit. Uh, it's a global summit, so we're all across worldwide. So be sure to join us. If you haven't already registered, go ahead and do that before we run out of time. It'll be in Knoxville, Tennessee, for those who are yep. appearing live at the summit who are going to be there in person. Mm -hmm. um, it's June... 14th through the 18th, two-day courses to start with, mm -hmm. three-day summit after that. Um, watch a different video if you want to know what the courses are or look on our website. And, and I really want to you know, invite you all to be there and encourage you to make the effort to get there because I know you'll take back lessons learned that will help your company's performance improve, that will help your people not get injured, not get killed on the job, and it really is worthwhile, and I've seen people every year take that information back and really accomplish great things with it, so I want to encourage you to be there. Taproot Root Cause Analysis is the world's leading systematic root cause analysis process, training, and software to analyze and fix real root causes. Here on Taproot TV, we want to give our viewers helpful tips, tricks, and other information to stop environmental damage, avoid significant 
uh, quality issues, eliminate costly downtime, prevent serious injuries, and most of all, save lives. Thank you for joining us today. My name is Emily Pritt, and today we have Marcus Miller, one of our VPs here, and a Taproot instructor to urge you not to wait, sign up today. We're talking about the Global Taproot Summit. Marcus, tell us what is the Global Taproot Summit? Well, for those of you that have not been to our summit, it, it is a time where people are networking. We have several, several best practice sessions. I mean, even if you're new to Taproot and you just want to learn the process, it's a great experience. You'll come away proficient with doing Taproot investigations. Mm -hmm. And if you are a Taproot user and you've already implemented a program, it's an excellent chance to learn how to mature your program over time. Mm -hmm. So for new people to Taproot, it's a great experience, a great networking experience, a great way to get information to, to make you a better investigator. And it's also a way to get ideas on how to take your program to the next level. That's very insightful. Thanks for sharing that. Um, why is it important, though, to sign up now? Why are we urging people not to wait? It's well, six weeks away? It's almost May. That's one reason, right? <laughs> yeah. it's, it's like right around the corner. And you know how time gets away from you. And, mm -hmm. you know, there's always a hundred things you've got to do. And it's easy to put a registration like this on the back burner. If you put it on the back burner, then it's time's going to be gone and mm -hmm. you're going to be pressed trying to get approvals or whatever. And you might not make it. And we don't want that to happen. And also, this year, mm -hmm. we're doing it virtually. That's you know, right. right. It's the best of both worlds. You can attend virtually. So why not sign up now? And if you're not sure of your travel plans or if you can make it or if your company's going to allow you to travel, just sign up virtually. And you can always change it later. Mm -hmm. That's right. And because it's virtual, like I said, it's the best of both worlds, right? Because mm -hmm. you get to attend in person, but everything's recorded. So then you're going to have the opportunity to look at any session. You don't have to pick and choose this year. Mm -hmm. You can go back and look at sessions that, you know, otherwise you might have to forego because something else was more interesting. Right. Um, and we've put a lot of time and effort into making this taproot level of excellence using a software we call Whova. Um, th with the Whova integration, we're going to be able to, whether we're in person, live here in Knoxville, or virtually, uh, use that software together uh, to have the, the best experience possible. And that's a really good point because I can see people waiting, like me, I would be nervous about attending something like this virtually. Like, am I going to get enough out of it? Am I going to be able to pay attention? Am I going to have distractions? But you're absolutely right with the technology that we've put together, uh, tested, with doing dry runs with, to make sure if you do attend, you're going to be engaged. We are going to capture your attention. Mm -hmm. You are going to have a chance to meet and greet the keynote speakers in a yeah. session, uh, the other Taproot uh, users, Taproot uh, presenters. Mm -hmm. So it's not like you're just going to be sitting at home watching the TV screen and wondering right. what's going to be on. You're going to be actively involved even if it's virtually. Yes. So we wanted to make sure that you sign up. Uh, it's a, a registration is, is online, so you do a couple clicks. Um, I went to registration the other day, testing it out, uh, and it is seamless. You get to pick the tracks that you want to attend. Oh, that's a great point, too, yeah. because we've made it easy for you to decide what would be best to, to look at. We have, mm -hmm. what, six or seven tracks. So if you're interested in one of the tracks, you hit a button, and then you're automatically signed up into the presentations that, that fit that track. Mm -hmm. But you also have the ability to customize if you want to. So if you want to attend you know, maybe five, four or five presentations about improving your investigations, but you also want to capture something in work-life balance, mm -hmm. well, you can choose to just do a one-off and, and take a, a course on work-life balance. Yes. So I'm, I'm looking forward to it. We've uh, we've got another. If you if you're new to Taproot TV, there's a previous episode. Uh, go and find it where we're talking about some of the integrations that we have built into to this the software and how we're going to make it fun. Mm -hmm. um, because learning should be fun. It's a conference, but we can still have fun doing it. Um, we're going to have a Taproot with a twist, which is something I've taken on. To um, we're going to have a virtual happy hour. So a lot of different things to take that element, like you're saying, where it's not going to be bored staring at a screen. We're going to put the two, the live and the virtual together. So it's it's like you're here. We want you here, but it's going to be like you're here if you can't be. Yeah, you are a trooper for volunteering to do the virtual happy hour. <laughs> Way to yeah. go. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have taproot around the world with different drinks and, and appetizers. Uh, we're a global company, so why not? There you go. That's a good reason to sign up now to attend the virtual happy hour. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is there uh, anything else you want to add, Marcus? Um, I'm like, shamelessly self plug. You know, I'm teaching uh, a two day course during the. Um, 
pre-summit to teach new Taproot users how to, how to use Taproot. It's our mm -hmm. essentials course, and that's in person. But we also have an opportunity for you to sign up for our Taproot Essentials virtually as well, in case you can't get here to Knoxville. Mm -hmm. And then there's a really great presentation by John Boyle I want to I wanna really promote. Uh, it's how to manage a major investigation. Because mm -hmm. a lot of people out there haven't, are new to, to the position maybe, or haven't mm -hmm. had to deal with a major investigation. And it's really nice to have a plan, right? right? Yeah. Plan it out before you need it. Mm -hmm. And John will help you do that. That's, I, I, that's one of the ones I'm looking forward to the most, besides some of the keynote speakers yeah, that we have that's coming. That's excellent. Um, you know, that's another, if you want to know about our keynote speakers, there's a video that talks about all of them. And we've got some really great speakers this year I'm looking forward to. Uh, we've got Knoxville native, uh, played football. His name's Inky. He's got a very motivational story. There's, um, We've got an Olympian, a former Olympian, lots of medals and giving that gold medal mindset, um, plus many more. So check out that episode as well. We'll put the links down below uh, so you can see that. That's a teaser. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, thanks for stopping by, Marcus. Yeah, it's my pleasure. I love doing it. Yeah, and thank you to our viewers and listeners. We hope to see you again next week. We do have our Tabret TV each week. It airs Wednesdays at noon. It's on Facebook Live and here on YouTube as well, and all uh, podcast platforms. So please subscribe, ring the bell, and we look to see you next week. Thank you.